I actually agree um, uh, so much with uh, the discoverability issue. Um, the, uh, China has been a very good example of not doing such uh, small things like having the domain in Chinese language because that never existed. They, uh, their internet has grown phenomenally without having to use domain names in Chinese. But the entire internet in China practically runs in Chinese only. What about email addresses? They don't, most of them even don't even have email addresses. They have worked around everything, right? So, uh, starting from payments to messaging and everything else. It's pretty well done. So, uh, so, uh, so I won't go into that. What made China uh, be able to solve all these problems? I wrote a blog about that after visiting. But uh, so some of the things that we should probably be focusing on is, uh, so Google kept keeps saying that all the content in the internet, 56% of it is in English. And I question that itna sara content English ka kaise ban gaya, kisne sare logon ke sar pe banduk rakke bola ki tumne, tum English mein content create karo. Kisne nahi bola, right? All that still got created because people voluntarily created. And it is because it was an ecosystem that had a solution, right? So when, 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 when the internet was in English and people were working on many different things, the keyboard was easy, that were, there were uh, different solutions that people were building, the fonts were beautiful. And so everybody was working on one part of the problem to solve and so the ecosystem was growing and people kept on creating. So similarly, there are creative people for every language. Everybody wants to write a poetry or, or, or a blog or whatever. You know, people love to express and create. So facilitating content creation is the most important thing. And focusing on that has uh, remained elusive to us for Indian languages. So I take Gura's point that you know, speech is definitely one key solution to it. The second is that even if we have auxiliary uh, you know, support for content creation, we cannot forget the basics. The fundamental comparison of English with Indian languages has been one of the biggest blunders. English kaise likhte? A se lekar ke Z pad lene ke baad, humko sirf spelling bol diya jaye to hum likh sakte hain. Lekin A se lekar ke H pad lene ke baad, koi spelling bole to hum apna naam nahi likh sakte. Because we still need, there is a three- We still need to see the first language, first sentence in the Indian language in the conference, sorry. <laughs> this is the first sentence, I've <laughs> <laughs> waiting. No, I've said kuch tog bol chuket. Well, uh, well, okay. <laughs> yeah, so uh, what I'm saying is, so if we want to write any of the Indian languages, there are, there, it's a three-step process in learning itself because that's the property of our, our uh, language's writing. So how do we write our language? First of all, we read the word. After the word, we read the word. We read the word. What happens after the word? That all the consonants are written with the word. They are the ones with the vowels. Right? And after that, what do we read? We read the word. We read the word. Yuktakshar. Only then our writing is known to us. Now, if there is a three-step process in learning how to write, how do you expect that one would end up learning how to type all on his own? And that's the expectation. And that, therefore, we keep on saying that it's difficult, it's difficult, it's difficult. The fundamental need is probably to go back and start teaching in schools. Schools mein hum padhate hain. In fact, my son who started school uh, three years or four years ago, उसको नर्सरी क्रॉस करते ही उसको कंप्यूटर्स पढ़ा रहे थे और उसमें एमएस वर्ड पढ़ा रहे थे पेंट के साथ में एमएस वर्ड में क्या करते हैं लोग टाइप करते हैं तो हिंदी भी पढ़ाते थे लेकिन हिंदी में टाइपिंग नहीं पढ़ाते थे राइट सो यू हैव असाइनमेंट्स इन हिंदी यू डू हैव राइटिंग सेशंस व्हाई डोंट यू हैव अ टाइपिंग सेशन व्हाई कांट यू हैव एन पोएम और क्वेश्चन सेशन बीइंग रिटन इन हिंदी at least if the kid learns the fundamentals of typing, he will learn it forever, right? So we don't have those. We know it that it is very difficult and still we don't cross these barriers. So content creation is another big problem to be solved. The third massive deter that we had is that I think that majority of the good quality content got created in the 90s. And from mid of 2000s until now, the content on the internet has been practically bad, not really that good in Indian languages. I'll give you re uh, reasons for that. Because until the, uh, in, in the 90s, publishers were entirely dependent on the digital DTP, jisko the, and DTP industry flourished. Itna sara flourish kaise kiya? Kyunki 8-bit fonts ke upar mein wo log depend kar rahe the. Jab font standards move ho gaya, open type fonts aage, 
तो जितने जितने भी डिजाइनर्स थे हु वेर ग्रेट एट डिजाइनिंग डिड नॉट ऑल्सो हैव द एबिलिटी टू राइट ओपन टाइप टेबल्स बिकॉज इट रिक्वायर्ड प्रोग्रामिंग नॉलेज इट रिक्वायर्ड एडिशनल लॉजिक which they did not have as a skill and after that the font industry literally has died where if you could search and get hundreds of fonts aaj ke date mein indian language font agar aap dhoondenge jo unicode support karta ho ikke dukke bas ginne mein aate hain and those either some enthusiasts who are greatly knowledgeable have created or microsoft and google who have funded and have created after spending a lot of money and time and yet not great quality because they are not passionate people who are created they are probably they have created because they they were paid for it right so those things died why because we did not have we, we did not have a vision towards backward compatibility we did not want to move the technology so that we can also take along everything that was pre created right so the open type standard itself was so bad now i would so the my wish list is that we must teach how to type we must facilitate content creation we must be able to hear for the first time i would say that probably government can take some measures to go back on standards and actually correct certain things and enforce backward compatibility there is enormous amount of great content that has already been created which is undiscoverable because of this right and so content uh, so legacy content ko use karne ke liye uh, thoda sa incentivize karna padega because although people have created a lot of tools etc to help legacy content discovery and conversion but still a lot of that is missing so a degree of incentivization is also important now uh, the the last point is about the mandate even the most recent mandate about mobile phones so i agree completely with rakesh here is that you know we have mandated something that is appearing primitive कौन एस एम एस यूज़ करने वाला है आज के डेट में वी आर स्टिल डिपेंडिंग ऑन द मेजोरिटी ऑफ द पीपल एक्चुअली डोंट यूज एस एम एस एनी मोर दे आर यूजिंग व्हाट्सएप राइट सो द आइडिया इज दैट इफ द मैंडेट हैज टू बी देयर इट हैज टू सपोर्ट द विल एंड देयर फॉर इट शुड बी हंड्रेड परसेंट लोकलाइजेशन प्लस कंपेटिबिलिटी सो इफ यू सेंड अ मैसेज फ्रॉम और इफ यू लुक एट द सेम कंटेंट ऑन एन एंड्रॉयड फोन एंड एन विंडोज फोन एंड एन आई फोन देन दे आर लाइकली टू लुक डिफरेंट बिकॉज दे आर नॉट इंटरऑपरेबल an interoperability problem is also getting solved in probably the wrong way so now those same phones are not going to be interoperable even with the uh, with, with the feature phones in which all these languages are getting mandated so, so the can you, can you explain why this interoperability problem is happening yeah yeah so so iske liye mereko thoda sa technical jana padega now we already had solved all the script and language display issues way back in the 1970s and in 80s we released standards that actually told exactly how the script display should work in the digital medium after open type got introduced by microsoft and, and adobe they focused on the glyph grammar instead of script grammar and because of that what happens is that if you use your android phone or windows device or even on apple ek consonant ke sath mein aap do teen matrain jod sakte ho सो वॉट हैपन्स इज दैट मुझे अगर औरत लिखना है मैं वही औरत को पांच तरीके से लिख सकता हूँ जो औरत दिखेंगे तो सही लेकिन वो उसके पीछे कैरेक्टर्स अलग अलग होंगे ना हाउ वुड यू सर्च दैट एंड इफ यू सेंट दैट वन सिस्टम दैट एक्चुअली टेक्स केयर ऑफ ऑल ऑफ दैट वुड शो इट एज औरत अनदर विच डजेंट प्रोबेबली विल शो यू समथिंग एल्स राइट सो द इंटरऑपरेबिलिटी फेल्स आउट देयर सर्च फेल्स शॉर्टिंग फेल्स एक औरत आपको आप अगर आपने लिख लिया एक लंबा चौड़ा सा लिस्ट एक वर्ड आपको ऊपर दिखेगा एक बीच में एक नीचे भी दिख सकता है राइट सो वेयर एग्जैक्टली यू स्टार्ट यू डोंट नो यू गेट स्क्रूड सो वी हैव बेसिकली फंडामेंटली स्क्रूड अ लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स फॉर आवर लैंग्वेजेस ऑलरेडी ऑन आवर ओन हमने खुद कर लिया है विदाउट फिक्सिंग सम ऑफ दीज इट्स गोइंग टू बी टफ सो दिस इज दिस इज माई वेस्ट लिस्ट सो इन ऑल अबाउट नाइन और टेन आई हैव मैंशन द मेजर वंस एंड आई थिंक दैट्स वॉट आई लेस्ट ऑन दैट होपफुल नोट Thank you all for being here uh, and participating in this conversation.